Factsverse presents The Most Secure and Off-Limits Places on Earth Help us spread the word about Factsverse by clicking that like button, and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. Number 1. Area 51 If you've ever seen any extraterrestrial-based movie, you've heard of Area 51. It's located in the remote Nevada desert. It's also a place that nobody is allowed to visit. You'd need to have special clearance from the military and the U.S. government just to set foot near Area 51. Many alien enthusiasts believe that this is the place where aliens and alien spacecrafts were found after one crash landed on Earth. Ufologists have said that in 1947, an alien spaceship crash landed near Roswell, New Mexico, and this is where they're holding everything that was recovered. According to the U.S. government, this is just a place where new aircraft technology is being developed. Whatever's located in Area 51, though, the government is trying to keep it under wraps. It's strongly guarded to keep the public out. Number 2. The Coca-Cola Vault Coca-Cola is one of the highest-selling soft drinks in the world. There are soft drinks that resemble Coca-Cola, like Pepsi and RC, and the store brand version of cola. If you've ever tried these drinks, you know they don't quite taste like actual Coca-Cola. And the reason for that is they have a secret formula for Coke and it's always been kept in a secure vault. The recipe wasn't always in its current vault, though. The first place where it was located was at the Guarantee Bank in New York. A man named Ernest Woodruff took out a loan from the bank to buy the Coca-Cola company. When the loan was repaid, the secret formula was then moved to Sun Trust Bank in downtown Atlanta, Georgia. There, it was placed in a secure vault, and not even the bank employees have access to that vault. Finally, the secret formula was then moved for the last time when the world of Coca-Cola was opened. Visitors can visit the vault of the secret formula, but you will never get inside the vault. Even the employees of the world of Coca-Cola are not allowed inside the vault. Number 3. The Ark of the Covenant The Ark of the Covenant is where the Ten Commandments are held, or so the story goes according to the Bible. According to the story, the Ten Commandments have been esconed in a chapel for 3,000 years. It's said that the stone tablets were taken to King Solomon's temple. Well, the story's not been proven true or false. But if the Ark of the Covenant really is where the Ten Commandments are being stored, it's no wonder why it would be kept such a secret. If it does exist, legend says that it's a wooden chest covered in gold, and the lid cover is described in the Book of Exodus. It's said that inside the chest are two stone tablets that contain the Ten Commandments. Also, we have no way of verifying whether or not opening it up will melt your face off. Number 4. Google Data Center over the past two decades, Google has become one of the most technologically innovative companies in the world. The company was founded in September 1998 and it went public in 2004. Today, it is worth over $200 billion. Google's most valuable possession? It's data. That's why it's very well guarded. The data center is located in Lenoir, North Carolina, and at this facility, over 3.5 billion queries a day are processed. You wouldn't be allowed to visit the data center, though. Very few Google employees are allowed to visit. Less than 1% of all Google's employees have ever set foot in this building. The center is heavily guarded 24 hours a day, 7 days a week to keep people out. Number 5. Zhang Su National Security Education Museum This museum opened in 2009, and chances are you would not be allowed inside. So, what's the point of having a museum then, right? Well, unless you were born and raised in China, you can't get in. But if you were born in China, you can. No big deal. It's considered to be a spy museum, and it holds technology that the Chinese don't want other countries getting their hands on. They're worried that if anybody other than the Chinese get inside, they will steal their secrets and their technology. Even if you are Chinese, by the way, but you are not born in China, you're still not given access to the museum. Number 6. Lascaux Caves In 1914, a group of French children were playing in a cave when they discovered what turned out to be some of the earliest cave paintings in existence. It's believed that the drawings in this cave are 20,000 years old. There are other sites like it, 
However, Lascaux is one of the oldest and the most famous. For decades, you were allowed to walk through the caves and view the paintings, but the caves are closed now to the public. Scientists found that when people were visiting the caves, the CO2 that they exhaled was starting to cause the caves to decay, and that prompted an immediate closing of the cave. The only people allowed inside today are scientists, and even they need special approval and wear special clothing and masks in order to keep the CO2 levels from rising. It's essential to keep the paintings safe, even if we don't get to see them. Number 7. The Bank of England Vaults If you're planning a trip to England, don't put touring the Bank of England vaults on your itinerary. You're not going to make it through the door. Just a very few elite are allowed inside. It's because it holds most of the wealth that exists in the entire English nation. Inside the steel chambers are 400,000 gold bars, each one worth between $1,400 and $41,000, depending on the size of the brick. This place is so off-limits, even England's royalty is not allowed free access. Queen Elizabeth was only granted a private showing once back in 2012. Since then, no member of the royal family has ever been inside. This vault is heavily guarded by armed guards at all times of the day and night. Number 8. Moscow Metro 2 Joseph Stalin was an evil dictator, and he tried to keep plenty of secrets so that people would know what he's all about. He had a secret police force, secret underground bunkers. He even tried to keep the countrywide famine a secret. He also had a secret metro system that was designed to take him to anywhere in Moscow without anybody knowing. If there were a danger, he'd be able to get on the train and get out quickly. The secret railway system is said to have been built during World War II, and Stalin used it until he died in 1953. The railway is so secret some people doubt it even exists. The reason that there is so much speculation, if it does exist or doesn't, is because nobody is allowed or ever will be allowed to see it. Number 9. Pine Gap Pine Gap is a top-secret military base. It was built to maintain security in Australia and North America. The goal of the facility is to monitor the presence of warheads, nuclear weapons, and satellites. If anything destructive comes toward the United States or any of its allies, the troops at Pine Gap will find out in plenty of time for a counter-strike. For years, people doubted the existence of this place because it is strictly off-limits to just about everyone. The only reason we now believe it is real is that it can be seen on Google Maps. Also, there have been some NSA documents that were leaked, and these documents confirmed the existence of Pine Gap. It's located in the desert of Australia, but don't try to get too close. You're not going to be successful at seeing it. Number 10. Mesgoria Mesgoria is Russia's equivalent to Area 51. The area was originally used to store nuclear technology that was very important to Russia during the Cold War. When it ended, the Cold War that is, the whole area, including the surrounding town, was closed to the public. According to a recent consensus, the population of the town is now 17,352. Since non-residents are really not allowed there at all even to visit, many people believe that the people who do currently live there work with military technology, maintenance, and construction. Nobody really knows what's going on in this town because the area is completely closed off. The people who live there, they don't get visitors. They don't leave the town either. It's a very creepy mystery and it leads to a government cover-up kind of situation. Number 11. Snake Island People call it Snake Island, but it's actually called Ilha da Quamare Grande. It's located about 40 miles off the coast of Sao Paulo, Brazil. The island covers 110 acres, which is equal to about one-tenth the size of Central Park in New York. Pretty small. The island is very unique, though, because it is home to about 4,000 types of snakes. People avoid visiting this island because some of the most poisonous snakes in existence call this island home. The Golden Lancet is one of them. It's found in no other place on Earth other than this island. People don't avoid the island because they want to. They avoid it because they have to. The only people allowed on the island are those who work for the Brazilian government. Number 12. The Vatican Secret Archives The Vatican Archives are located in, of course, Vatican City. 
When it comes to historical value, the archives' value is priceless. If you want to visit the Vatican archives, there's a good chance you will not be allowed to. The only people who are allowed to enter are members of the diocese. You'd also need to learn Latin or at least show your intent to become a serious scholar. Inside the archive are letters from famous Enlightenment philosophers and historians. There are documents inside that date back to as old as the church itself. This is the most famous religious place on earth, and it's the most difficult to get into. Number 13. Bohemian Grove The Bohemian Grove is a place where the richest and most powerful men on the planet gather for two weeks each year. It's a 2,700-acre campground located in Monterio, California. For two weeks, these powerful men drink their weight in alcohol, and they have secret talks. According to them, they're just there to look at the redwood trees. Uh-huh, right, wink. The people who have been there over the years include United States presidents, oil barons, singers, and celebrities. There is a rule that business deals are to be left outside, and there's a rumor that the only business deal made there was in 1942 when the Manhattan Project was planned, resulting in the creation of the atom bomb. If you want an invite to the Grove, you can get one, but you're going to have to put up a lot of cash. Since its creation, only one person has been able to infiltrate the camp. It was in 2000, and a Texas filmmaker named Alex Jones got inside. According to a spokesperson for the Bohemian Grove, it's just a ceremony for traditional music drama celebrating nature and summertime. When Jones released his footage, the spokesperson confirmed the authenticity of the footage, but said that his comments about the Bohemian Grove are inaccurate. It's said that since Jones infiltrated the camp, security has been increased. Number 14. North Sentinel Island This island is very remote, and it's located between the coast of India and Thailand. It is so remote that it has been untouched by the modern world. The only people who live there have been there for hundreds or thousands of years. Since nobody has spoken to the residents, though, we really don't know how long they've actually been there. Technically, the island is not off-limits, but people don't go there because the people who live there, the Sentinelese, are extremely hostile. In fact, in November of 2018, a young man tried to make contact with the natives. He was met with an attack of spears and arrows. The man's name is John Allen Chow. He was last seen by fishermen heading toward the island. The next morning, the fishermen saw what they think was Chow being buried in the sand. When talks of retrieving his body began, it was decided that it would be too dangerous to do so. The people on this island are so dangerous that the government even refuses to send special forces to this location. The government fears anybody who attempts to get on the island will be killed immediately. They also worry about the risk of a deadly epidemic of flu, measles, or other outside diseases on the island because they've never been exposed to them. Number 15. Surtsey Island Surtsey Island in Iceland didn't always exist. There is high volcanic activity in the area which caused the island to emerge from a hot spot beneath the surface of the Earth's crust. Since this newly formed island was discovered, it has been strictly off-limits to the public. The only people allowed there are the scientists who are trying to preserve its burgeoning ecosystem. Scientists won't let you onto the island, and it's heavily guarded. A few people have tried to get onto the island, but so far nobody without strict authority has been permitted in. Number 16. Poveglia Island The bubonic plague, also known as the Black Plague, killed between 30 and 60 percent of Europe in the 14th century. Now, to help you understand that a bit better, three out of every five people were killed due to the widespread disease. The people of Italy would ship all of the people who came down with the plague to this island, and there these people would die horrible, painful deaths, decomposing right there where they died. Most people believe the island is cursed and wicked due to the many people who died there. There are signs on the island stating that it's off-limits. Many people think that there could still be traces of the Black Plague left in the decomposed bodies, another reason not to go. Others are sure the entire island is haunted. Since it's illegal to set foot on the island anyway, much of it has still gone unexplored. Number 17. The Svalbard Global Seed Vault 
The Svalbard Global Seed Vault is one of the most remote buildings on the planet. It was built to withstand the downfall of humanity. It's located deep in the North Pole Norwegian Mountains. It's one of the most forbidden places on Earth, and inside the vault are seeds of all types of plants. If there was an apocalypse and we needed to replenish the Earth, there would be plenty of seeds here in order to make that possible. Because the seeds would be so important to sustain life if necessary, only botanists with the highest security clearance are allowed inside. It's incredibly difficult to get to the vault, so even if you could get in, it might be too hard just to get there in the first place. Number 18. North Brother Island North Brother Island is located between the Bronx and Queens. In the late 19th century, the island was used to quarantine people who were believed to be spreading illness. Now, if that doesn't make it scary enough, it's also the site of a tragic ship fire that killed over a thousand people. There's a hospital on the island, and it has been abandoned for years. Due to the island's past, it is off-limits to most people. With a history like that, who would really want to go there anyway? Number 19. Room 39 North Korea itself is a place that's off-limits to just about everybody who doesn't live there. Its military power is at odds with most of the world, and that makes it a very dangerous place to be. Also, the North Korean government controls what the people of North Korea see and hear. If they start allowing tourists in, they won't have control over what the people learn. Well, there's a place even more secretive than North Korea itself. It's a secret place inside North Korea called Room 39. And it's not just a place, it is a secret group as well. It's their job to maintain a slush fund for Kim Jong-un and other important people in the country. According to a defector of North Korea, the room contains counterfeit U.S. $100 bills, drugs such as opioids, heroin and amphetamines, and secret weapons. Number 20. UN Buffer Zone The UN Buffer Zone is located between Greece and Turkey. It's a place where a civil war once took place. Today, the ramshackle buildings are cut off from the public. The area is surrounded by barbed wire and thick mesh fencing. There are plenty of buildings in the area, but nobody is allowed in. Number 21. Fort Knox You knew this had to be on the list, right? Fort Knox is a military base in Kentucky. It's off-limits to anybody except for the people assigned to guard it. Inside is most of the country's gold reserve, and for added security, there are thick wire fences and landmines around the building. Number 22. Chernobyl Chernobyl is located in the Ukraine and is the site of the most severe nuclear disaster in history. The incident occurred April 26, 1986. The radiation leaked into the ground and killed everything in the vicinity. The radiation was so harmful that everybody who lived there was immediately evacuated. And today, it is a ghost town. It looks like people just picked up and left in the middle of what they were doing, which is probably exactly what happened. Tourists can visit, but you're told to do so at your own risk. Number 23. Admax Admax is located in Florence, Colorado. It is the highest maximum security prison in the United States. It's one of the most heavily guarded prisons in the world. The outside world is kept out entirely from this prison. It's home to some of the most dangerous criminals of all time. Several terrorists who took part in the 9-11 attacks, they're housed here, as are many members of Al-Qaeda. Domestic terrorists such as the Boston Marathon bomber, the Unabomber, Terry Nichols, a co-conspirator of the Oklahoma City bombing, and several double agents are housed there. These inmates get no visitors, no phone calls, no mail. The area is off-limits to everyone but the guards who work there. Number 24. The White House Situation Room You can tour much of the White House, but the Situation Room is off-limits to everybody without the highest level of security. To get inside, you have to be handpicked by the President himself. Number 25. Club 33 Club 33 is one of the most exclusive clubs in the world, and it's located in the strangest of places. It's right in the middle of Disneyland. Only the rich and famous are allowed to be members, and it costs $40,000 to become a member. If you have the money, you should be patient, because even with that, it's still a 14-year-long waiting list. So which of these secure and off-limit places would you like to visit? 
Tell us in the comments below and subscribe for more.